it's Casey with GoBankingRates.com. It's that time of year again for our annual 12 Days of Finance contest, which lets you vote for your favorite personal finance expert of 2014. Let's see who's in the competition this year. Most people think that debt is a four-letter word, which it is. And they keep saying, get out of debt, get out of debt. But if you're going to be financially intelligent today, you have to know there's good debt and bad debt. When you start living on a plan, you're going to realize you've been spending more than you make. You're spending money you don't have to buy things you don't need to impress people you don't really like. Stop it. You need to buy food at a grocery store for you to eat. You do not need to go to a restaurant. They surely ought to avoid credit card debt. I mean, there's no reason in the world to pay 18% per month. I can't make money paying 18% per month. So why, why should people up and down the street you know, do that? I think the number one thing that parents teach their kids about money is staying away from debt. I think debt has become a huge roadblock for our generation. When we harbor negative feelings with money and about money, what that ultimately does is creates a mind trap in our head. Money is a tool that you're supposed to use in pursuit of that life. Money is not the end goal. To get ahead financially, you have to set goals. Be realistic with your goals and be as specific as possible. Whether it's business coaching, consulting, life coaching, or just overall general personal development, I'm here to help you grow it and grow your business. How can you make sure you're financially prepared for one of life's biggest surprises? We're talking about healthcare. Today, I'm talking about ways that you can earn some extra money and have some fun. This is not free money. This is not a windfall from the government. This is your hard earned money that you accidentally overpaid for the government to hold on to for a whole year. Don't forget, voting happens all December, so come to Go Baking Rates every day and vote for your favorite expert at this link. Happy holidays.